थ्री Well, the Vedanta Group has been in focus all this week, whether it's with regard to the parent Vedanta Resources and the yields out there, and the Indian listed company as well, Vedanta Limited. Plenty of of questions remain, but we have with us Mr. Anil Agarwal, who's speaking to us here at CNBC TV 18. Well, Mr. Agarwal, thanks so much for joining in, and uh, we're looking forward to you clearing out all those doubts. So let's start off first up. You know the bond deals on Vedanta Resources; they are factoring in a possible delay or a default in terms of payments. What do you want to say on that front? The yields have surged up from around 25, 30, 35% as well. Any doubts out there or are you confident you'll make the payments as you've done in the past? Uh -huh. You know, we have we we had a company which 30 billion dollar revenue hmm. next year coming year will make 9 billion dollar profit. Right. Our debt to equity ratio is one of the best in the world. so there is no question of 1 billion 2 billion when said making payment when you have this kind of for our internal resources mm. i'm very comfortable to make this payment but there is there is a bank money available there is a there is a people money available so we take that money you know when i have always seen that sometime the people don't want india to grow mm. and who are the company growing the few hand pick companies are growing right. and they try to throw something where india can be pulled down there is no question of it is a it is a amazing company which has been div highest dividend paying company mm. shareholder has made a money we raised 35 billion dollar and very comfortable every penny has been made yeah. um, uh, so there is no question we have number one we have enough internal accrual to take care of all our debt payment on the parallel we have enough resources to raise debt mm. which is the regular business of ours to to make sure that each payment is made on time last 15 years never this kind of raise there never been company was such a good shape yeah right and never been this question been us right you know mr agarwal your vedanta resources normally all the payments if i look at the previous quarters you have made it in advance and by a good margin and this time around there are a couple of payments that are coming up say in the next couple of months which they are still outstanding so that's why the street is a little bit jittery on vedanta resources but you are telling us that you are confident you are going to be uh, making those payments more than confident more no. than more than confident as far as the bond is concerned is sometimes there is a opportunity people to make money <laughs> where, where for people to make money where you will get this kind of yield hmm a common man should buy this bond because this is a 50% gain hmm. because boss has some this is the greatest opportunity hmm. uh, uh, to make money on vedanta bond right you know i, I appreciate your optimism mr agarwal but uh, what about refinancing is that an option today there were various reports that indicated that maybe you're talking to various bankers and you're looking at refinancing these debt payments is that on the cards no debt and equity hmm. the two thing right whether you take debt as a refinancing or take as a debt it's a debt right and we have to have a debt and equity without that we, because we have we are in a who has set up plant for oil and gas spending 20 billion dollar right. who has set up the plant for 20 billion dollar for zinc hmm. only producer of silver right who has produced put in 17 billion dollar in aluminum opening the bauxite mine to the uh, smelter to uh, complete value chain yes the, who has done the optical fiber all over the india we are the largest optical fiber these all are monopoly business is not a monopoly business is a business which is very hard to replicate right very capital intensive i feel very proud that this kind of asset has been created in india and we got all the money from abroad brought in here we we put in this money and we don't work less than by and large hmm. 30% margin yes we have 100000 people working all right by and large there is no union hmm. or everybody who work for me is my family so with this kind of strong position yeah 
कुछ तो लोग कहेंगे लोगों का काम है कहना <laughs> no, but, uh, Mr. Agarwal, no, we appreciate the workforce that you've built and uh, you know the assets that you've built as well, which is quite phenomenal. But just before we move on, I wanted to question you that in the next 12 months or so, close to one and a half billion dollars of repayments of maturities come up, and you're confident about making them, right? We have made, we have said that in two years time we will make four billion dollar payment mm -hmm. we have already done before payment two billion right this two billion dollar to be made in by june july it is absolutely very very comfortable yeah even with the internal accrual the kind of money we are throwing we can pay right but it is our business to take the debt yes and if we this is a machinery which is working Right. And whoever give us a position, but it is, it is it is a company which has a track record. We have a huge, big company. This is small number. What you're talking, one or two billion. Yes, it's a very small number for Vedanta. And we take that on board then, and good to see your confidence in terms of these repayments. Let's focus on the Indian listed company Vedanta Limited. Now, there's a large proportion of your holding which is pledged, and the street is getting a little bit jittery out here. But, you know, you have put out a clarification when we wrote to you. I just wanted you to clear the air in terms of your positioning on the pledge holding that you have, both in Vedanta Limited as well as Hindustan Sikh, Mr. Agarwal. I don't think Vedanta Limited has any pledge. Only Hindustan Sikh 6% share has been pledged. Right, right. And uh, this is the part of system. But if you look at the overall debt in the company, yes, the total debt in the company is $12.5 billion. Mm -hmm. Twelve and a half billion dollar. Hmm. Against we are going to make nine nine billion dollar profit. Right. So is a is a hardly any debt. Right. With a capital intensive uh, capital incentive uh, business. So I'm very comfortable. Sometime the some bank insists to have some share pledge for for this, but we are not pledge people. Right. Hardly any share is pledged. We don't need to pledge any share. Right. So, so, Mr. Agarwal, you know, as for the uh, Bombay Stock Exchange and the NSCA, the, the way they reported, it appears that it's a pledge. But you're clarifying here that none of the loans are an actual pledge. It could be a top-up that the banks have asked for. Are we, are Absolutely. We except the 6% share on Hindustan, on Hindustan Zing. Zing is pledge. Okay, all right. So, you've cleared the air on, uh, on that front as well. Uh, also, a quick word in terms of the current global environment. Everyone's fearing there will be a bit of a slowdown. What's your thought on that? Will you go a little bit slow? And you have seen multiple cycles, Mr. Agarwal, in the last many years. What's, what, what's your take? Definitely. There is a huge pessimistic hmm. in, in the world. Hmm. And uh, there is a huge inflation. Mm -hmm. Prices are going up. A com, uh, but India has become in a sweet spot. Yes. Because the aspiration of the people are very high. People who are in a cycle want a scooty, scooty want a scooter, yes. the scooter want a car, you know, they want a good school, they want tap water, they want electricity. So the people, the lower middle class people, hmm. there is no question they are going to jump into the middle class. And when that happens, the demand is going to be very, very high. Right. So I have, I have personally feel that the, we are in different position. And the sub biggest thing is our government is very, very strong. Right. That has been established. Mr. Modi, our Prime Minister, is a darling of the world. Hmm. So he's a tall leader. Absolutely. That also gives a lot of, lot of confidence um, uh, uh, to the people. You know, two things necessary to do. India has a chance to be the first world. Yeah. India has a chance. We, I can see the hope. We eradicate our poverty. We create massive job. Yes. And and we have a sanskar also. We have our culture also. I think when the uh, government machinery system accelerate mm -hmm. and start faster decision, yeah. benefit of doubt has to be given to the other side. Right. And judiciary, or phenomenal judiciary we have, one of the best judiciary. But if they start working faster. I think that will fuel for our, our, our growth. Uh, to answer your question, yes, the world is is thinking of going through recession. Yeah. But India definitely in a sweet spot. Yes. 
and with entrepreneur india is a land of opportunity india is a land of opportunity uh, entrepreneur india is a land of youth yes india is a land which is a uh, which is a culture so all, having all this and with a strong government yes i think i have a i'm a very optimistic i think is a great time for india to scale it up well we'll slip into a short break to come back we've got lots more to quiz mr anil agarwal as he clarifies his position on the vidanta group and his plans ahead hey ladki